Welcome back. On this Wednesday, we are going to think about our health, especially as we head into these cooler months. I recently spoke with Bachelor, Bachelorette star, author as well, Andy Dorfman. She has some really fun ideas about how to stay healthy and well. Let's take a look. If the last 18 months have taught us anything, it's that health and wellness is an absolute priority. Shedding some light on this topic from a news survey is Andy Dorfman, wellness guru and New York Times bestselling author. She's also sharing some tips about her own health and wellness journey over the past two years. Welcome to the show, Andy. Thank you. Thank you for having me. So tell us more about this survey. Yeah, so this sh this survey comes from Shackley. Um, obviously, we've all known them to be in the health and wellness field for decades now, but they decided to conduct a survey of millennials to look at kind of some of the health topics such as stress and sleep and energy and see how those areas have changed and how millennials feel about them since the pandemic. And it's really, really interesting looking at the results. Um, just for starters, they found that 70% of millennials are more concerned about their health and wellness now, more so than they've ever been their entire lives. And that's a big number. We can all relate to the stress of the past two years. What does your wellness routine mm -hmm. practice look like and how do you make time for it? My wellness routine is all about balance. You know, I do like exercising and eating healthy, but I also love to indulge. And I think it's important to show ourselves a little grace. Um, and I think it's about kind of finding time. You know, I prioritize my health. I think it's the most important thing we have in life is our health. And so prioritizing that throughout the day, whether it's 10 minutes or 20 minutes, um, even if it's five minutes, you know, take time for your health, take time for the most important thing in your life. And also I think when it comes to time, you know, the study showed, and we all feel that there's not enough hours in the day. How do we kind of maximize that time? How do we make it the most efficient as possible? For me, I'm a huge fan of supplements. Um, I love the Miology uh, by Shackley, which is great because it's like a pre-planned, already personalized little supplement plan for me. And I can just grab it and go. Little things like that, whether it's grabbing nutrition on the go, um, you know, or just carving out five minutes, that all adds up to kind of this balanced and healthier life that I think we're all trying to achieve. And as mentioned, stress is definitely a barrier to health in many ways these days. So what else do you find to be mm -hmm. a barrier and how do you overcome it? I think for me personally, and, and based on the study, a lot of millennials, uh, another barrier is probably energy. You know, we all want to wake up feeling energized and most of us just aren't feeling that way. Um, a great way to combat that. Um, I love the sustained energy boost from Shackley. Uh, it's a great drink for me before a run. You know, I'm, I'm training for a marathon or training for a race. Um, I love a good energy boosting drink. That's my favorite. Um, but yeah, you're right. You know, other than stress, I think energy is probably the next thing that millennials are definitely struggling to kind of overcome. And what other advice or words of encouragement can you share with us that, especially those who are struggling to feel healthy right now or trying to get through this strange, unpredictable time? Yeah, I think for those that are struggling right now, my advice would be pretty short and sweet, and it's just to start start right now. Don't wait till tomorrow. Don't make excuses, whether it's a tiny thing each day, whether it's a major life change, that's up to you. But don't wait for tomorrow to start your health journey today. Oh, it's such a great message. So where can we get more information about everything we talked about today and any other exciting things that you have on the horizon? Yeah, you can get more information um, on Shackley.com about the products, the survey. You can also check out their social media um, and check out my social media as well because I'm going to be sharing some tips and tricks, also some of my favorite products by Shackley, and also just overall some advice on, you know, our well-being and health and kind of hoping everyone kind of follows their own journey and follows mine as well. Well, thank you so much, Andy Dorfman. It's been a pleasure speaking with you today. And thank you so much for your advice and words of encouragement on our health and wellness journeys. I really appreciate your time. Thank you for having me. I appreciate it.